welcome back to another unboxing with Danny and Jazz. Hi! And today we're going to be unboxing a couple of parcels from across the pond in the US. Um, basically, long story short, um, our friends AK Reviews, Aaron, um, he offered to help us get some Funko Pops that I had to get in the US, in the, US, in the UK. Um, so big thank you to Aaron. I mean, without you, this wouldn't have been possible. And these pops are absolutely awesome for me personally. And you were like one of them as well, don't you? Yeah. <laughs> so big thank you if you're watching. Um, there is three pops that I know of in the bottom box. And one mystery one that he said he picked up at his local, um, I think it was like a second hand shop. He said it was a little diamond in a rough. And I know what this one is. This is straight from the Funko shop to his house in Enterman. So let's see what's in it, Jazz. Yes. Which, should we know, open the top one, the one that we know first? Or do you want to leave that at the last? I'll let you pick. Which one are we going for? Oh, so, right, first one. Open the box, open the box. Open the box, open the box, open the box. The box is now open. open. So yeah, this one is from the Funko shop. As soon, it was, as, soon as it was announced, I asked um, Aaron to see if he would get us this. And of course, he said, yeah, because he's top lock. Um, this is absolutely brilliant. As soon as, it, as soon as it came out, I was like, I need it, I need it. Didn't we, when, we, when it all... When it all... Um, you can't remember what it was? No. It says on the box. Oh, I do, I do know. <laughs> Put that there. Showing everyone what it says. Oh well. Wait. Gotta find out anyway, Anna. Yeah. It'll be in the title, won't it? Be careful. No. Oh. I don't know. Good bit. It's actually smaller than I thought. Yeah. It is so cute. This anyway. Um, <coughs> this uh, is Piper. It is a Disney short. I can't remember what film it is before. Can you? I don't know. Um, yeah. So it's Piper. It's absolutely brilliant. This. Um, <laughs> yeah. I'll leave the link. In the description um, to the short, so you can watch that and know what we're going on about if you don't know what it is. Um, what are you doing? Open it. Why? Because I don't want it open. Okay. Anyway, yeah, <laughs> so I'll leave it in the description below. Um, go watch it, it's absolutely brilliant. It's just about a little seagull basically that um, is scared of going and getting food, and in the end, he conquers his fear. Be careful. Please be careful. Oh, look at him. He's going to have to stay in this though, isn't he? Really? Yeah. Just the background and everything. Anyway, go on then, John. So yeah, Piper, absolutely brilliant. I'm sure this... Um, I can't remember how much this was. Something like $17, I think. I think. But I'll find out. Did the freezer just kick in there, guys? Yeah. <laughs> He's so cute. He is so cute. So yeah, that is Piper. No doubt these will probably come to EMP. Not 100% sure if they will, but as it's been a, as it's a Funko shop thing, um, like Boa and Bauer, sorry, and um, like other Funko shop ones came to EMP, but it does actually take a canny few months. So, but that's if they do get it. So yeah, that is Piper. Jazz, can you put that down there for me? So these are out the way. Oh. Cheers, Chuck. So I can just display Piper in all his hair. In its glory. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So yeah, uh, this is the second parcel that came. Um, this is brilliant. I know what's in here and I know what's going and I'm so excited. 
but dangerous. I know three of them. What's the matter? Dangerous. I am dangerous, but I don't care. I'm excited. Oh, no. Oh, There's a surprise thing in there, so I don't know. I've just seen bubble wrap on the top. Bubble wrap. Paper. Oh, oh brilliant. <laughs> nice, nicely packaged. That's why we like getting pops from other collectors, because they know how to package them. <laughs> so yeah, four sort of boxes. Uh, four pops. They say I know what three of them are, so which one should we go for first? Which one's it? Oh. Three. You know, which one are we going for? This one that I've already opened. Have you them off me? Yeah. <laughs> Why? Because I know you can really open them. I'm not, you're going to knock that off it, I know you are. Mm. Anyway, so open this one, this is the first one. They're in pop protectors, I think. Is Steve Baskin Robbins exclusive Stranger Things pop? And he actually went out on the morning and um, picked us this up from a Baskin Robbins. Um, that's in, in my eyes. That's, I can't be more grateful for that. So again, thank you. <laughs> Been quite solid, that. Eh? Yeah. So yeah, Steve Baskin Robbins. I think the only difference in this one and the common is ice cream. He's got, is it like a banana split or it's like just a ball of ice cream instead of an ice cream, isn't it? That's a difference. Yeah. yeah so. Try open it. Um. Uh. No. Okay. <laughs> no, thank you. <laughs> um. I might do. I don't know. I'll think about it. Mm. So yeah, next one is <laughs> oh, it's paper. It is it Dustin. Is Dustin. Dustin. Stranger Things Walmart exclusive camp 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 uniform. Yeah, I think so. Yeah, Sorry. yeah. I think it's um totally. It's got. The difference between this one and the common is yeah, different t shirt and pants. And this is which is Walmart pants exclusive, as you can see by the Walmart sticker. Am I taking this one out? Yeah, you know what I'm like about my sleeve pops. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> don't take them out. So yep, Dustin Walmart. I know there is quite a few Dustins um, being done. There's the common, there's this one. There's the one that comes in the um, t-shirt box. So you got to pop in a t-shirt. It's in like a, is it like a tool kit or something? Or a lunch box or something? I think it's a lunch box. Is it? So yeah, that's another Dustin one as well. I do like the Dustin Pops. There you go. So yeah, that is, has it got a rattly head? Yeah. Yeah, I've got about, I think that's the sixth one now, mm -hmm. the rattly head. Anyway, I think the rattly head is just a, a bit of glue. Yeah. That's come off. So. Sorry. Mm -hmm. Shall I make it do it? No, it's okay. Oh. So yeah, that, that is the second pop in this box. Dustin. As you can see, there's probably a theme going on here. What did you just do there? Did you just see what that other pop was? So we have oh. 11. Can <laughs> <laughs> you do this object? <laughs> I'll put the army. It's 11, also from Stranger Things Hot Topic exclusive, where she has her hair tied back and wearing a red coat. Yep. I do I'll, I do like this pop, like you say, it's the Hot Topic Exclusive 11. I just think, I mean, Stranger Things is my thing. Um, it's just, I think they've done the 11 pops uh, over and over and over again. But because I've got the collection, I'm going to have to get them. It's the same with um, the new Comic-Con exclusive, the Gold Demogorgon. Um, I don't like it, but I have to get it yeah. <laughs> for my collection, so... 
let me know in the comments what you thought of the gold Demogorgon that's coming out for San Diego Comic Con. This must be, 11, the 11 pops must be the most done pops ever. Out most of everything. Made. Yeah, most made. Thanks, Jazz. Mm. <laughs> so yeah, 11. I personally think the Demogorgon pop is just like, just tacky. The gold one? Yeah. It does, doesn't it? So like no need to go on but better than that. How many through there's the demo dog, the demo garden, the six inch, the ten inch. Yeah. yeah. Like why do you need more? It's just, I bet you they're trying to make them as many as they do eleven. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, so that's the third pop and the fourth pop is You open it. Really? Yeah. <clears throat> Mark this down on your calendar, I'm allowed to open one. <laughs> Hold it. Oh, that's different. Nice. Um, that is nicer. So we have. That's right. Is Leonardo from the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles? Yep. F Y E exclusive. Is that white or grey? Would you say grey? Yeah. yeah. Grey. So it is the grey one, the F Y E exclusive. That's cool there. So that will be going behind me in my collection, if you can see it. On the top of the rest. Uh, so that is, are you opening this? Yeah, go on. It's going to be coming out and going on the back over there anyway. Oh, yeah. So. But yeah, why Jasmine gets that out, I just want to say a big, another big thank you to Aaron at AK Reviews. I'm going to link his YouTube channel in the description as well. Go check them out. They do reviews on figures, um, unboxings. They do, they do all sorts. Um, quality channel. So go show some love and subscribe. So yeah, that is an awesome pop. So yeah, that is our, what should we call it, Jazz? Like a, a US, US haul. Um, again, big thank you. Can't thank you enough, Aaron. Um, let me know in the comments, everybody, what you thought of these, what you think of the fact that they've done 100 million 11s. Um, have you managed to get, because I know um, Pop Culture, we're sticking these up. It's going to go down. Um, we're sticking these up, but didn't have the Baskin Robbins exclusive sticker, which is the main thing, because you're getting it from Baskin Robbins. Um, so, yeah, let me know in the comments what you thought of today's video. And also, don't forget to like, comment. <laughs> Share, subscribe, hit the bell for post notifications because you will be entered and could win a mystery box giveaway at the end of the month. Yep, and as always, thanks for tuning in and we'll catch you on the next one. Cheers, bye. Bye.